Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Cooking Goth, and tonight I'm up here at Pizza Hut in Bridgeport, West Virginia, and I'm gonna try their brand new stuffed cheese it pizza. I just got the stuffed cheese it pizza. I learned whenever I went in there to buy this that these actually just released today. Um, I had gotten the ones with pepperoni. Everyone in there was nice to me, they were great. Um, the atmosphere was really good. Everything seemed like it was clean. Um, I didn't go walk throughout the whole you know, store because I just wanted to go in there and get my stuff. Um, but I want to get this out. I, whenever I went in there and got it and I got it in my hands, um, I opened it up a little bit and I could just immediately smell the cheese it. And then I closed the box and I came walking out here and I could still smell the cheese it coming up from the, from the box even though I had it closed. Um, is this is how big they are. First I'm going to take a bite and uh, without the without the pizza sauce. I haven't gotten to the, the gooey cheese inside yet. Um, I definitely taste cheese it. Yeah. The cheese inside is kind of like a paste. I know um, it's um, night, so I don't have very good light right now. Um, hmm. There's supposed to be pepperoni. I see. So tiny, tiny pepperoni bits inside. Hmm. I thought they were going to put mini pepperonis in there. Um, now I'm going to try it with the um, with the sauce. Ooh. Oh crap. Oh no, I spilled it. Right on my hand. Uh. Uh, I don't want to see. Oh crap. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Sorry folks. You could definitely taste the cheddar. Um, it's not something I don't think I would personally buy them again. They're kind of a nice novelty. I'll give it that. They don't taste bad at all. Came to, they were like six something, um, probably almost seven dollars. And the sauce, the marinara sauce, I think it's marinara, yeah. Um, kind of I don't know why I said I think this is marinara sauce. I know it's marinara sauce, but uh, um, the 
forgot. I brought one vanilla Coke with me to drink. They're not dry, but I definitely do need something to drink. Um, I don't think they're as bad as what people are making them out to be online because these are getting uh, crappy reviews online. If someone bought them for me, I would definitely eat them. I was starving, I'd definitely eat them. Um, they are good, but it's not something that I would go and crave. So, this is probably going to be the only time I get them. But, this is my review. And, I want you guys to have a fantabulous night.